what you need. It's what you need. What's up, everybody? I'm here at the Hollywood Roosevelt Hotel with my man Jamie Chambers. Well, no, we. What's up, man? How you doing? Real well, real well. Just got the 60th anniversary for KTL. 60th anniversary? Yeah, well, here's the real person right here, Stan Chambers. Stan He's Chambers. He's been here for 60 years. Come on in here, Stan. Yeah, okay. this is the guy you want to see. Stay right there. Oh, cheers. Hi. How you doing, Stan? Good. Good to see you. This is the man, Stan Chambers. He needs no introduction. The 60th anniversary for KTLA. Yeah, isn't is that, that amazing? It's hard it? to believe that uh, those 60 years went by, but KTLA has been right here in the heart of the city for all those years and meeting a lot of people, showing a lot of stories, and the good part is every time you turn on Channel 5, there it is. Definitely, and uh, you guys just have a connection too, like you're all fr friends and family, and like when you guys do it, you know, it's just, it looks so fun, you know, yeah. you guys have fun. Well, I it's think not like you're doing a job, you're just... Trying to have fun with your with your viewers, you know. I think that's the secret. It, it is fun, and I think the morning show is the perfect example. You've got these wonderful, talented people. Every day it's a new situation. They're kidding, they're playing, they're laughing, and they just have fun. And uh, you can't do better than to have your work being fun. That's that's what it's all about. So, Mr. Chambers. How did you get started in the KTLA? What was, what was your what was your first break? Who did you meet? You know, you know what I mean. Well, the interesting thing, I was at uh, KUSC at, at, at USC and heard that a television station was going on the air. I didn't know that television existed, so I just got the idea for a television show. Went to the telephone a week later, called them up. They said, "Well, come on by, let's talk about it." There you go, and it just happened. Huh? That's how it started. What did you guys do for? Well, I know you did, the, of course, the. Uh, Good to see you. And. Man, they're all over the place. It's just the KTL crew. It's like everybody is here. Yeah. The Hollywood Roosevelt Hotel. They must be happy. Yeah. This is just the whole team. It's really, really nice, and it's fun. And we rarely get a chance to, to be together like this. So we've we've enjoyed uh, sharing moments and uh, all those stories over the years and all the places we've been and the things we've done. It's it's really great. Now I know you guys did the uh, Rose Parade for uh, New Year's Eve. What about after the Rose Parade? And you know, what what type of parties do you have for Christmas? Like, what's the back end of KTLA that we don't see on TV? Well, I think really, but most of it is right out there on the screen, because uh, like whenever we go to the Rose Parade, your whole uh, your whole life for a couple of days is just focused on that. Mm -hmm. You do rehearsals, you do uh, changes, and you, you just kind of work at it to, to, to try to make the whole situation work. Got it. And uh, when you've got all those floats, you can't miss. That it is. And so, are you a religious man? Or yes. Like, what, what, who is Stan Chambers? You know, besides KTLA, who, what are you about? Well, I've uh, been here all my life. Uh, got a good-sized family. have 11 children. Wow. And, uh, Eleven Jamie children. Jamie is my grandson. Oh, Remember you were talking? Yes, here right Jamie now? Chambers. Yeah, yeah. So we are kind of a tight-knit fam tight family, and we uh, get along real well together, and we all live in Southern California, so that's nice. We have this basis for the family. Well, that's KTLA all the way. I don't want to take up too much of your time. Thank, Thank you very much, Dan. We really appreciate it. Now, where did Jamie go? Where did Jamie go? Oh. Stay tuned for more, you guys.